I know you are busy and it can seem so overwhelming to even think about adding a workout into your schedule. But that is why I have created this 20 minute express leg day because I believe it is much better to work smarter than to work longer. So I have structured this workout today to be super effective at helping you build lean, strong legs as well as just get an awesome workout in and feel better by the time you're done with it. So we have 20 minutes today. So the only thing I need from you, 20 minutes, go heavy on your sets. We have a super set workout as well as a no repeat workout. So the 20 minutes is gonna fly by. And I am telling you by the end of it, you are gonna feel so much better and so happy that you clicked play. Now let's go ahead and get into our warm up because we don't wanna waste a minute of our time today. We're gonna start by marching it out high knees. So arms up, we're gonna alternate legs here. P.S. If you've got your ankle weights, grab those for this workout as well. Really extend and pull that knee up. Just take a few minutes with me here to get warm. Make sure we are ready to go heavy right from the get-go. Three more. Here's two and one. Take your legs out wide. We're going to go into bum kick. So bringing those heels back towards your bum. Now the structure for today's workout, like I mentioned, is super set. So we're going to work two exercises back to back. We get one shot at each each exercise, so really make sure you are going heavy, making each set count. Uh, work timer, 45 seconds on. Rest timer after those two exercises, 30 seconds. Three more, here's two and one. Now we're gonna go into a squat, squat pulse. So we're gonna hold it down for two, pulse it down and up. Pulse it two and up. And squeeze the glutes at the top. Three more, two lateral lunges next. So take those legs out a little bit wider if you need to. Toes going straight forward. We're gonna take it from side to side. And down, you can start as you get warm here. You can try to take a little bit lower, starting to stretch out through the inner thighs here. Three more, here's three, two, and one, we're gonna bring it center, toes turn out, going into a sumo squat. So we're gonna take it down, hold it, walk those hands out right above your knees. We're gonna drop one shoulder down to the center, press back here, opening up the legs, and then other side. Keep that bum drop down. One more on each side, and then we're gonna talk about that first superset. Last one here. Good, let's bring it up. You can just march it out here for a second, getting warm as I let you know what we have for this first superset. First superset, you're gonna need one dumbbell for goblet squat. Then we're gonna go into squat pulses. So we're gonna have two dumbbells. So you're gonna need one dumbbell for goblet squat, two dumbbells for your squat pulses, and we're gonna get into this. So grab your dumbbells, meet me back here, and let's do this. All right, goblet squat first, getting into position, shoulders rolled down and back, and let's go. Keep the weight in the heels. And squeeze at the top. Whew. So glad you joined me for this workout today. I know when you are busy, it's like, I don't even wanna think about adding one more thing to my list of to-dos, but I'm telling you, Getting your workout in will make you feel so much better. And that's why I love short workouts. I'll tell you what, you will be amazed at what you can accomplish in 20 minutes. When you just focus, you push, you go all in. We're almost there. Remember, move quick right into that squat pulse. Switching it up, here's three, two, and one. Grab your dumbbells, squat pulses. Dumbbells come up on the shoulder. And let's begin. Keep it low. Now, if you need to come out of this, come out of it for just a second and then right back in. If you find dumbbells are too much, you can always set those down. Keep it low. Oh my. At least it's a no repeat, right? So it's just one time. Keep it strong, you got it. You're gonna get 30 seconds after this. Yeah. 
Here it is. Three, two, one. Amazing. Now we're going into a kickstand Romanian deadlift. You're going to need one heavy dumbbell for this. Grab your dumbbell. So whatever leg is forward, the dumbbell is going to be in the opposite hand. That other leg is going to come back. Hips are going to be square to the ground. Shoulders roll down and back. Breathing. Five seconds out. Here's three, two, and one. And squeeze, squeeze, tighten that hamstring and glute up here as you pull back up. Back stays flat, dumbbell nice and close to that leg. Almost there, we're just gonna switch sides. So we're gonna work one side here, super set it with the other. Here it is in three, two, and one. Switch it up, just going right to that other side, and let's go. So you can see with super sets, it's about just getting right into that next exercise as soon as you can, minimizing the rest in between. You're doing amazing, keep it up. Almost there, 30 seconds to rest. Five seconds out. Three, two, and one. Now we're gonna need two dumbbells. Now you have a modification because this is gonna be a stationary lunge move. So if lunges bother your knees, I definitely wanna have a modification for you and that is going to be the uh, rear leg lift. So you'll see that modification on screen. Grab your dumbbells though. We're gonna do pulses with these stationary lunges. We're gonna work one side and then the other. So bring one leg forward, shoulders roll down and back, pulse it for three and up. Here we go. So pulse it out, three, two, one, all the way up. Back to pulsing, three, two, and one. Whew. Now you can count your own pulses here. As you're counting, just make sure you've got that good form. And up, squeeze, good. Keep the weight in your heel on that front foot. Legs, oh my word. So remember, we're just gonna switch sides. That's the superset combo, one side and then the other. Here we are, three. Two, one, take it over other side. And let's begin. Pulse it out for three, two, one. Push through that heel. And up. We're over halfway. Keep pulsing. Almost there now. Here it is. Three, two, and one. Nice. All right, we're going into sumo squat, and then we're gonna super su su super set that with a close to stance squat. Sorry, that was a lot of S's all in one right there. So get your dumbbell or dumbbells for sumo squat and for that close stance squat. Let's see. All right. So out into sumo squat, going in five. Here's three, two, and one. Squat it down and squeeze. Oh. 
As you push up here, as you push through the heels, think about squeezing the inner thighs together. Whew. That's one thing when you're training. Make sure you think about the muscles you're working. That will help to activate them more. Also keep that good form. If you're just going through the motions, I gotta say, might not be as effective. Last three, two, and one. Close stance squat. Grab those dumbbells. Dumbbells are gonna come right up on your shoulders. Feet nice and close, and here we go. Keep that chest up. Whew. Almost there. Whew. Good, here's three, two, and one. Nice. Now we're going into calf raise pulses into an alternating curtsy lunge. Now alternating curtsy lunge, again, if that bothers your knees, you're gonna do a glute bridge on the mat. So get your dumbbells for calf raises. Uh, I'm gonna stick with these, cause we're pulsing. And then we'll do those curtsy lunges. Five seconds out. Here's three, two, and one. So try to keep those heels off the mat, pulsing here in this calf raise. Just a little up, a little down, keeping tension in those calves. Whew. Now you can always drop it down for a second, and but then get right back into it. Oh, hey, I got some good news for you. We are over halfway. Oh my word. Did I just, uh, yes I did. I just, we are over halfway. Oh yes, so excited. Alternating curtsy lunge here in three, two, one. Oh, here we go, alternating curtsy lunge. Keeping that chest up. Oh. That forward leg, always keep the weight in the heels. So you don't wanna rock forward on your toes and keep that chest up. Whew. My, we're close. 30 seconds is coming. Good, here's three, two, and one. Nice, all right, 30 seconds to rest. We're gonna go into now a single leg glute bridge on the mat. So get your dumbbells for that. I'll actually probably use these. One thing as well as you, if you have it, um, your ankle weights, that, those will be coming up soon. So if you have your ankle weights, grab those. For this single leg glute bridge, I'm gonna cross my leg over. You can keep your leg up as well. But we've gotta go in three, two, and one. Here we go. Lift and squeeze. We do have a lot of unilateral training today, meaning we're working one side and then the other. Whew. So that's helping us focus on that one side, helping our balance. So a lot of benefits to unilateral training. So we're taking advantage of that today. So remember, supersetting is just, the superset will just be switching sides. <sighs> that time is almost here. Keep lifting, keep squeezing. <sighs> Good, here it is in three, two, and one. Switch it over, and let's go. 45 on the clock. Now, for your ankle weights, if you have those, 
We're gonna put those on and we'll just leave those for the last two supersets. If you don't have ankle weights, no worries. I'm telling you, you will still feel these exercises. But just a little added resistance if you have those. And if you don't have them, I'll link them down in the description below if you're interested in adding those to your collection. They are actually an amazing little addition, I'll tell you. Whew. Here we are, three, two, one. Nice, all right, dumbbells out of the way. Let's get those ankle weights on if you've got them. We're gonna do rainbow on one side and then rainbow on the other side. So bringing it down, now for the rainbow, you can be down on your forearms. You can also be up. But take that leg out wide. We're gonna make that big arching rainbow here in three, two, and one. Good, so really think about making that big rainbow from one side to the other. Keeping your core engaged and breathing. I like to think of this as like the fine tuning work. We work the, the big muscles with the squats and now we can really target the glutes here with this one. So we're just gonna switch sides and that is coming up. Getting ready to count you down. Oh, I love it. This is three, two, one. Switch it right over to that other side. So leg out wide and let's go. Whew. Oh, the glutes are on fire. Oh my goodness. But listen, we are almost through this workout and what did I say? You will be amazed at what you can accomplish in 20 minutes if you put your mind to it, if you go heavy. Whew. And just the fact that you showed up, I think you're amazing. That's the hardest part sometimes is just pressing play. Almost there. Three, two, whew, one. Nice. So again, keep the band, or keep the ankle weights on. If you want, we're gonna bring it up here for a squat. Alternating lateral leg lift. So those are really gonna add some nice resistance. Dumbbells will be up. We're gonna superset the squat with alternating leg lift with a wall set. Yep, we got it going on today and this is our last superset. Two more exercises. Here we go in three, two, and one. Now as you lift, keep that foot flexed. Getting the outer thighs here. We've worked the inner thighs, we've worked the outer thighs, we got the glutes, the calves. The I don't think we missed anything today in the lower body. So we're gonna move quick right into that wall sit. Again, you can just keep your ankle weights on because we're just gonna be holding. Here's three, two, and one. Right into wall sit. And here we go, hold it. Chest is up. Think about getting a 90 degree bend here with the legs. Try not to hold on with your legs and take that pressure off. If you need to, just hang the legs or you can just gently let your hands rest. Oh my word. The shake is amazing. And I said, by the end of this workout, you might be feeling shaky, but you were probably feeling so amazing and just so happy that you showed up, taking time for yourself to get stronger. It's an amazing thing. And I'm so, so excited that you joined me. 20 minutes, we got it. Here we are, three, two, and one. And I know you're busy, but if you like dessert, the stretch is waiting for you. I'm waiting for you at the stretch and I'm telling you what, it will close out. This is the, the icing on the cake. So go grab the dessert. I will see you over there. Don't forget if you're interested in the ankle straps, you or the ankle weights, you'll find those down in the description below. And I love ya.